Hello everyone and welcome to Sit With Wit. Today, we will highlight local author Dana Copeland and writer of today's story, The Power of Affirmations. We will also highlight key details and affirmations. Key details are important pieces of information in a story or text. Affirmations are positive statements that help you to overcome challenges and negative thoughts. Are you ready to get started? Okay then, let's begin. Hi, my name is Kimari. My name is Kailea, and we're sisters. Mommy and Daddy say affirmations are powerful and that people in life will have you doubt yourself. Focusing on them daily allows our inner voice to remind us of who we are, so we start every morning the same way. We stand in front of our affirmation station and pick one affirmation to focus on for the day. I am helpful, Kailea cheerfully stated. I am brave, affirmed Kimari. Mommy picked, I am strong. Daddy picked, I am a leader. Now, we are ready to start our day, Kailea declared. See you later, Mommy, Kimari and Kailea shouted as they hopped out of the truck. Be helpful and be brave. Love you, girls. We will. Love you more, they yelled from a distance. Love you most, Mommy lovingly replied. As Kimari walked Kailea to her classroom, they both stated their affirmations again. I am helpful and I am brave. During math time, Kailea noticed her friend Mason was sad. He didn't understand the math problem. She could hear the small voice inside her whisper, I am helpful. She quickly leaned over and helped him solve the problem. He was so happy. Kimari loves her friends in class, but not everyone is friendly to each other. She saw someone being mean to her friend Drew. She heard the small voice inside her whisper, I am brave. Even though she was scared, she told her friend to stop and reminded her that we should be nice to everyone. Drew smiled and said, Thank you. That's what friends are for, Kimari proudly proclaimed. Before they knew it, the day was over. Daddy, they cheered as they ran hand in hand to the truck. What was the peak and pit of your day? Daddy asked as they drove home. The worst part of my day was when my friend was sad because he didn't understand the math problem. The best part? was when I helped him solve it. What about you, sister? Kailea asked. The pit of my day was seeing someone being mean to my friend, but the peak was when I was brave and told her we should be nice to everyone. I'm so proud of you girls, Daddy exclaimed. The next day started the same way. Today, I am joyful, Mommy said. I am kind, Daddy stated. I am a friend, Kimari said. Hey, I was going to say that, Kailea sadly exclaimed. You both can focus on being a good friend today, Daddy replied. See you later, Mommy. Love you, Kimari and Kailea yelled as they got out of the truck. Be a good friend today. Love you more, girls. Before they could say anything, their friend Cameron bumped into her sister, Anique. She dropped her lunchbox and folders. Her papers went flying everywhere. They looked at each other as they heard their small inner voices whisper, I am a friend. Kimari declared, affirmations are powerful. They smiled because they knew exactly what to do next. Pop quiz, Kimari and Kailea are A, cousins, B, 
sisters, or C, friends? If you answered B, sisters, you are correct. When Mason was sad, what affirmation did Kailea say to make him feel better? A, I am happy. B, I am strong. C, I am helpful. If you answered C, I am helpful, you are correct. Stop and talk. What are some affirmations that you can start saying to yourself or to someone you care about? Be sure to purchase your copy of The Power of Affirmations today, as well as follow Dana on social media. I hope you enjoyed today's story. Be sure to start your day with a positive affirmation. Well, that's all I have for you today. Until next time. Bye.